Hello, um, my name's Steve McGann. I play Dr. Turner in TV's Call the Midwife. Oh, yes, my name's Laura Main, and she I play remembers. Sheila Turner. We've married to him, and we are here for the Good Housekeeping Christmas photo shoot. Look how well we turn out. <laughs> Look at us. Ladies first, thank you very much. And which member of the cast is most like their character? Well, don't look at me. Do you think it's me? Am I like, am I, am I being like Sheila? No. <laughs> no. I think you're completely, I think you're so different as your character. Don't you think she's different as oh, a yes, character? No, I don't really get recognised. So yes, so if, you, if you've got somebody, say, who oh, do you think? Oh, I would say Fred. Don't you think Cliff is like, is like Fred? Do you know what, he did actually come to yeah. mind, to be fair. Yes. Yeah, I think he is. I think that's one of his strongest things. <laughs> I think he's wonderful. Imagine having Fred working with you. Imagine how brilliant that is. <laughs> oh, that's what good. we get it with Cliff. Good. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah? Yes, Cliff is like Fred. Ah. Uh, what has been your most emotional call and midwife moment of all time? Uh, we are a very emotional programme. There's a lot of those. But there is one. Um, oh, well, seeing as you're sitting here, do you remember when, when Teddy Turner was born? Oh, yes, I do. Now, we were outside the door. I, I was outside the door when you were giving birth. I had to actually sing through the door to my in labour wife. What was it? I sang. <laughs> Once I had a secret love. Once <laughs> I had a secret love. But I did it. Like, I was like desperate husband, so it was like, what? Because I, yeah, I, I wasn't letting him in the room, you see. I Not me personally. But you know what? Sometimes you do stuff on this show, and it's so moving as a program that you just get so used to this emotional range of it, tenor of it. You're, you're quite beaten up afterwards. Some of it's really heavy duty stuff. It's something, isn't it? Mm. But we love it. We love it. We love it. I've got two. Can I say my two? I've got two emotional moments. Oh, go and on. one is collecting, um, meeting our the daughter that we oh, adopted, yeah. little Angela. So going to the orphanage and that day, and just walking towards the cot and meeting yeah. her. That was beautiful, though. I love that. And do you know what else? But from a, a guest character point of view, I was really, um, and I'm still moved by the Philodemide storyline that, that um, Series 5 really presented really brilliantly. I think that episode one where the Philodemide child is held in the, her mother's arms yeah. is still one of yeah. my favourite moments ever yeah. of Call the Midwife. Yeah. And neither of us were involved. Probably why it was good. But the, there you are, and that was thus one of those beautiful, quintessentially yeah. call a midwife things. Whose yeah. go is it? Is it your go? My turn. It's your go. If you could take one prop home from the set, what would it be? I would take a sphigometer. A sphigometer? <laughs> Have I said it correctly? No! It's not a sphigometer. How do you say it? I just said it because I know I can't say it. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the blood pressure thing that you squeeze on your arm. How do you, how do you pronounce it? It's called a sphigmomanometer. Say it. Sphigmomanometer. Sphigmomanometer. No, I wouldn't Fantastic. take a sphigmomanometer. It would actually be quite handy to be able to just uh, keep an eye on your blood pressure, especially working with him. So, I yes, don't know I'd why like you don't just say home. blood pressure monitor. <laughs> is it my turn? Yeah. Cool. What is the one birth you'll never forget from the show? <sighs> I don't think that's that difficult. There was... Um, one that we call the epic birth and it was in series two and it's the brilliant Mon monica I, knew you were, I, I was thinking the same one and yeah. this incredible scene where monica had to play twin sisters she played two characters one of them was attending the other while she gave birth mm -hmm. there were complications with the birth there was a hemorrhage in the birth um, we were present managing to flirt with each other at the time <laughs> yes. and I was there was a fully choreographed Fight. Yes. All in the I same room. I got slapped. You did? Yeah. I think I got something across the <laughs> face as well. It was the most astonishing. It lasted all day. It was really yeah. hard to film. And we just know it as the old epic birth. Yeah. Back yeah. in those days. Remember and then, that? And then being you presented saved the with two life. twins. She ch saved the child's yeah. life. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. It was very yeah. good. She won the one. Who would be your dream guest star? 
And we've already had like loads of dream guest stars. The fact that Miriam Margulies has joined the cast, that's a bit of a dream. Apparently it was her dream. I mean, how amazing is that? This series, I mean, I do get a bit fangirly. Samantha Spiro we've had this year and um, Amanda Root and, you know, all these wonderful actresses keep walking in and I'm like, you know. Yeah. Makeup chair. So we've got loads of them. It is impressive. It is impressive who, you know, who call the midwife attracts. Who would be a dream guest star? Well, I was thinking about Laura Main, but she's probably quite disappointed. <laughs> I think she's available. Yeah. Mm. Um, no, she's very available. No, um, who? who? Can you, have you got somebody? I bet you do. Well, you know. If you put a phone call If out I put to a somebody. phone call into someone, I mean, anyone would do, darling, to be my wife and sit, you know. Um, I think if it was, I, I, I thought Sinead Cusack was a particularly good one. She's already done yeah, it. Yeah, 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 you know, I know. As Laura There's says, them, lots of them. It, it's amazing with a series like this because you can attract real talent. Can we on. announce that we did once get a letter from Whoopi Goldberg? Whoopi Goldberg yeah. asked to be. No, she didn't ask. Did she no, ask? She... Did she ask? I believe oh, so. No. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> See? So if we can make that happen, that'd be pretty cool. Okay, and me and Whoops, Whoops. me and Whoops, I'll get on the phone to Whoops, hey Whoops. Anyway, My that turn. would be awesome. If she's up for it, we want her. <laughs> Do the cast buy each other Christmas presents? <laughs> no. I haven't received one thing from you. <laughs> Did you feel the edge in that? Did you feel no, no, they don't. What, what have you got no, me? To be Laura? fair, to be fair, we have spent six months all together, which we love. Um, from, no, we do between April and October. So by the time December comes, we're all kind of living our own lives for a little bit before we're all reunited again next year. Is that fair to say? I'm taking your present back to the shop. <laughs> Is it your turn? I don't know. <clears throat> okay. Who is the most mischievous member of the cast? Somebody that springs to mind is um, Judy Parfit, actually, or Freddie Herdog. <laughs> He's not really a member of the cast. Um, yeah, she's got a very, very naughty sense of humour, isn't, isn't she? Actually, to be fair, I'm sitting right next to him. Well, me? <laughs> it's you. Oh, I'm shocking. I'm, I'm about five years old, <laughs> most times. But I, I'm worse with you. I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. Terrible. He's very mischievous, especially yeah. when you're trying to build yourself up for an emotional scene. I'm terrible. <laughs> I awful. must be He's a nightmare. to work with. <laughs> no. I must be terrible. I love you, no, And you know what? The thing is that we get on really, really well. Okay. And it's a good job, too. Shall I have a go? Yeah, you have a go. Mm. Right. What is the character you would most like to see return to the show? Gosh, that's really, really interesting. Mm. Because during a show like this, you get so many coming and going. It's a, it's a nursing precinct, a medical place, which means that you turn around characters. But if I had to see anyone again, who would it be? I think I possibly, straight off the top of my head, um, Sister Evangelina would be one, because I miss her uproarious take no nonsense kind of approach um yeah you but you i'm sorry we can't have a shower scene because that's the only way she can come back really what shower scene <laughs> you can't have her like it was all a dream oh no that's true <laughs> but i i thought we were going into the realms of imagination <laughs> fantasy land because but fantasy land would be to have pam around again and also also again. the wonderful charlotte ritchie Oh, don't I know exactly? And because we still going to make thing, everybody cry. But Charlotte is just so wonderful to work with, and I miss her horribly. Yeah. And she's brilliant, but she's yeah. doing really well. Yeah. We all love her. Yeah. She's always super fine. proud. Um, your turn. Okay, my darling. Thanks. You dig down there. Okay. Do you watch the Christmas special with your oh, family on nice Christmas one. Day? Yes, I do. If I can be in Aberdeen, I do, and I'm definitely going to be in Aberdeen this year, so I will be watching it. Will you? I um, definitely will be watching with my family. I watch it all the time, but it's a really, really weird thing, isn't it? Everybody else in oh, the yeah. country sits down to watch the telly in the afternoon. After the dinner, when yeah. they're all a bit tired, some of them are a bit drunk. And then we actually have to, well, not exactly go to work, but it does make you nervous, doesn't it? So there's that thing of Christmas Day where 
you haven't been able to relax because you know you're about to see your your big old mug on the yeah. telly. Yeah. yeah. It's still a privilege. It, it does make, like, I think as an adult, <laughs> it does make Christmas a little bit like exciting again, like you're a, like you're a child. Yeah. It's like, you've opened the yeah. presents, you've done everything. It's not like, oh, what do we do now? It's like, oh my God, my <laughs> show's coming back. That's true. It's very true. <laughs> what a geek. What a geek. <laughs>